Microblogging site Twitter has reacted to the federal government's decision to lift the restrictions placed on it in Nigeria since June 2021. The site in a tweet said, quote, We're pleased that Twitter has been restored for everyone in Nigeria. Our mission in Nigeria and around the world is to serve the public conversation, end quote. Twitter was accessible in Nigeria on Thursday after the federal government lifted a seven-month ban on the social media network. Meanwhile, small business owners and entrepreneurs of protein in Nigeria can heave a sigh of relief after the federal government lifted suspension on Twitter. Now, Twitter users have free access to the Bluebird app after seven months of the suspension. While many users are glad to be back on the app, others are indifferent. Has more. The seven-month absence of Twitter from the social media space in Nigeria ended with many rushing to tweet and retweet to drive conversations online. The Twitter ban was the federal government's way of asserting its authority and sovereignty. It also led to loss in revenue for the country to the tune of 542 billion naira. The suspension of Twitter created a market access gap for millions of small and medium-scale enterprises that use the platform to reach their customers. This made doing business in Nigeria difficult at the time when the federal government was promoting policies to enhance the ease of doing business. The recent decision to leave the ban on the microblogging site has caused a frenzy online. Some are happy to be back on the blogging site, but for others, nothing much has changed. So happy, you can see people trying to put in their business out there, reaching out to more audiences. You have people saying, okay, people like celebrities saying, yes, they want to reach out more to their fans. You have business providers saying, yes, we are back. We are able to introduce our services to you. So yes, everyone is so happy and you can really, really find it on the... Okay, at, at some point, it was slow. I'm like, please let me just go and put on my VPN. Like, personally, I've been so used to using VPN, so it actually feels weird to start switching normally again. My excitement is just something else. I'm really excited. I'm elated. I want to express my uh, gratitude to the federal government. I think they actually heard and listened to us. They heard our voices and called up the ban. So I'm so grateful. Even Twitter is glad to be back in Nigeria's social media space. The social media giant announced using its verified public policy handle that their mission in Nigeria is to serve the public conversation as they remain committed to a Nigeria where Twitter is used by people for commerce, cultural engagement and civic participation. According to agreed resolutions, Twitter is expected to establish a legal entity in Nigeria during the first quarter of 2022, appoint a country representative to interface with Nigerian authorities and also comply with applicable tax obligations on its operations under the Nigerian law. Now that Twitter is back, small business owners are more interested on how soon this will translate to improved sales and profit as the federal government seeks to tighten the regulations guiding the social media operations in Nigeria. TJ Suadiri, TVC News, Abuja.